Internal Revenue Service IRS Tax News. There's no new news today, so we'll just go into a random joke. I apologize in advance. It's crazy what the Hulk's turned into these days. What happened to you? And I don't mean a giant, raging, unstoppable green monster either. It's not his fault that he's an unstoppable killing machine. He's turned into like a sad, pathetic, giant green monster. But he's a loser. He's pathetic. I mean, in the middle of the first new Hulk show, the Hulk actually breaks out into song singing with a sad expression on his giant green face. I fought the woke and the woke one. I fought the woke and the woke one. I fought the law and the law one. But what about the law, you might ask? And I'll tell you what, the woke is the law around this town. There ain't no law. The only real law around here is the Cowboys. This here, this is the wild woke west of Hollywood movies, man. Nobody does nothing without them. I mean, they're it. You gotta have a quick woke draw around here if you want to survive. You must be Doc Holliday. <coughs> That's the rumor. You retired too? Like, I mean, if the Hulk went into a Starbucks, for example, and somebody called him a bigot. Not me. I'm in my prime. Despite him being like the only green dude in existence, the Hulk's only hope would be to have his finger on the trigger ready with a solid woke comeback. Yeah, you look it. Or the Hulk would be mauled by the Starbucks mob. The Hulk would have to fire back calling the dude dudette or dude X. Dude X being the non gendered dude term, in case you were wondering. Hey, Peter, in case you didn't know. So the Hulk would have to call the dude X like, a non-gender affirming jerk. That sucks! You jerk! Or something like that. You might think it more devastating to call someone like a rapist or a pedophile even or something like that, but actually... Actually... In the wild woke west of Hollywood movies, those things actually have no negative stigma as long as you're affiliated with certain gangs. I swear to God. Law dog, you don't step aside, we'll tear you apart. So you need to know who you're dealing with. It's far safer to call somebody like a, a non-gender affirming jerk. That's about as low as you can go with name calling in the Wild Wilson Woke West of Hollywood movies. He's hit us below the belt. Golly. You non-gender affirming jerk. The only gender we don't affirm around this town is the actual one. Dang it, sons bitches. And then the entire Starbucks will likely throw all their coffee at the dude X. You racist jerk! I hope you get foot and mouth disease! Not even worrying about getting sued like McDonald's for hot coffee being thrown at people. Because the law don't apply to people like that dude X. The sneeze guard is broken! There is no law! In the wild woke west of Hollywood movies, man. That's what I'm talking about. Otherwise, the Hulk will be left singing his sad song. I fought the woke and the woke won. I fought the woke and the woke won. I fought the law and the woke won.